For some years now, the technology sector has been driving the global growth. This sector is also the source of the greatest disruptions of this century. Social networks, robotization, big data, there are more connected devices than people in the world. It is predicted that by 2025, more than 41 billion devices will be capturing data on how we live, work and move through our cities. My name is Louis Schreiber. My role is to assist portfolio managers in identifying risks and opportunities related to sustainable development. I analyze the products and services of each company in order to prioritize the ones developing quality-oriented solutions for sustainable development. I also study their environmental, social and governance-related practices to favor the companies who monitor their risks closely. This digital revolution is moving fast, very fast, and comes with risks to keep in mind. The protection of users' fundamental rights is a risk which we know all too well, but there are still many violations. This can be a company who misuses personal data or platforms for political manipulation or misinformation. The manufacturing chain is also a subject of analysis. From a social point of view, our focus is on working conditions in the extraction and assembly lines, which involve a large number of players and vulnerable population in less regulated countries. The funding of political instability in the Democratic Republic of Congo, with revenues from cobalt, is also part of this approach. At the same time, extracting and refining raw materials, as well as chemical treatment necessary for electronic component production, also involve high environmental risks with disastrous impact on the surrounding waters, land and populations. Another concern is electronic waste. This represents a risk for biodiversity as well as for the surrounding populations. Yet, we are consuming an increasing number of electronic products and too few companies are properly tackling this problem. Only 17% of e-waste produced in 2019 was recycled. While the exponential and unpredictable growth of technology makes it a sector to watch closely, it nevertheless offers almost infinite possibilities and can be a key driver in meeting the environmental and social challenges that we face. Beyond analyzing the risks, my role is in particular to identify the environmental and social solutions that the technologies can provide, and there are several of them, including internet access in emerging countries, which fosters both economic and social development. Internet provides access to information and drives knowledge sharing. It also provides access to banking services, which are key for the economic sustainability of households and SMEs. Less than a third of Africans are currently connected to high-speed internet. The amount of investment needed to guarantee universal, affordable and quality access throughout the continent by 2030 is estimated at $100 billion. Technology companies enable the uninterrupted flow and scaling up of sustainable solutions. For example, the smart management of electricity and water networks will eventually lead to better integration of renewable energy and less waste. But these are just a few examples. Electric vehicles, solar panels, state-of-the-art medical equipment, all these solutions rely on the development of new technologies. It is by connecting innovation to environmental and social ambitions that companies will cross the tech odyssey and shape tomorrow's world. Technology can increase environmental and social issues, but if we select the right solutions and the right practices, technology can instead accelerate the transition towards a sustainable model.